We have one final presentation for the president, and it uh, requires the assistance of Bill Dupler and Steve Shapiro. Please if you would, if you would please come forward, Bill, Steve. Thank you, me, Steve, Bill. All right. Some years ago, while serving on the ICC Board of Directors, then ICC President Frank Hodge referred to me, Steve Shapiro, and Bill Dupler as Mo, Larry, and Curly. Yuck, 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 yuck. Hello. 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 Unfortunately, the nickname stuck. Appropriately, we as Mo, Larry, and Curly, you see any resemblance? <laughs> Dr. Howard, Dr. Fine, Dr. Howard, Dr. Howard. Uh, would like to present the first ever Shemp Howard <laughs> Award <laughs> to an ICC board member who also displays stooge-like behaviors. <laughs> Would, uh, Bill, I think you have the honors as the next speaker. Thank you. You know, our friend Steve, much like Shemp Howard, was quite a strange fellow. He apparently was afraid of many things, and here's a few. He lived in constant fear of cars, never driving or getting a driver's license. According to Mo Howard, Shemp's brother, his fear was rooted in an automobile accident Shemp experienced as a youth. In his films, when, when Shemp had to fake driving a car, he was towed by a prop with men in a simulated car, but was still scared, nervously holding the steering wheel until the scene mercifully ended. Shemp also refused to fly in airplanes, traveling only by train. By, excuse me. Based on Steve Jones's flying experiences <laughs> this past year, I expect that Steve has also developed the same phobia. <laughs> you know, Shemp was terrified of strange dogs and would carry a big stick with him in case a strange dog approached him. He refused to swim or go in any body of water larger than a bathtub. Shemp always carried a pair of rubber overshoes in his pocket, lest he be caught in the rain. You might could use some of them this week in Florida. And Shemp was a chronic bedwetter. He actually served in World War I, but his stint was truncated due to his bedwetting. Sounds like a real basket case. He was also afraid of getting poked in the eye with two fingers and hit over the head with a hammer. In any event, the three of us have observed Steve Jones, his travels, his interactions, and his behaviors while serving on the ICC board and as your president. With admiration and only the best of intentions, wrong, we <laughs> consider it fitting to recognize him publicly as the fourth stooge. Go on, fill out that report. Mm. Oh. Come on, you, get gone. <laughs> that was a mighty swipe, wasn't it? <laughs> I fooled you, didn't I? Yeah. Oh! Oh! Look at that. Let go. Oh! Steve Jones, a.k.a. Junior, Junior. a.k.a. Grasshopper, yep. a.k.a. Jonesy, please come forward to receive the Shemp Howard Award. <laughs> the Shemp Howard Award presented to Steve Jones in recognition of his affable and stooge-like behavior this 30th day of September, 2014. <laughs> Step by step. 
very, very appropriate. 